guys, it's Nikki and today I'm going to be doing a jack-o'-lantern pumpkin tutorial. I don't know what I'm going to call it. This is in the shot. <clears throat> this is my rough sketch of what I want to do. So I'll see if I can make it happen. So yeah, let's get right on into the video. <laughs> I first started off by mixing Mayron Clown White cream paint with an Eye Magic Green cream paint to make the lighter green that you see on my chest and neck paint. Since cream paints don't dry down, I put a layer of translucent powder over it just to make sure I didn't smudge anything while I was doing the rest of it. Then I took that same white and mixed it with a yellow and peach color to make a yellow creamy base for the pumpkin. Then I took gel eyeliners and I made the mouth and the eyes of the pumpkin. I went ahead and took a makeup wipe and took off where I knew I wanted the black because I knew it would be a lot harder to cover up the black if I did mess up, so I gave myself kind of just a stencil to fill in. took a black eyeshadow and smoked out my under eyes and all the lines of the pumpkins to make it have a more aged look and I went ahead with that same black shadow and set the bigger places where the eyeliner was like the eyebrows, the eyes, the nose, and the mouth so it wouldn't smudge. Then I took an orange eyeshadow and filled in all the stripes and around the black but leaving the center of it so that I could highlight it and make it have more of a rounded look, like a true pumpkin. Then, taking a green and blue shadow, I went in and added shading and just distressing to all of the leaves and the vines coming off my chest. And for the last step, I went in with an eyeliner pen and really made sure everything popped and had definition. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you liked it, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below what you want to see me next. Don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you guys on Tuesday, I think. I love you guys so much, and peace out. Life is up here, but you comment below. And the comments will always become common motivation to promote your show's next episode. So your brain knows to keep going even though...